that's a great question. Every uh, every part of history, uh, every industry that I go into has their own take on safety, and it seems like hurdles at times for us to physically get this data that's going to help them so much. So it's all very. It's, it's not genericized. It's different. Every crane is different, and every time you go into a different facility, it's different. You'd have to get with your, your safety guys specifically, work up a good game plan. How can we take this data without being in harm's way and do it within those guidelines and then collect it? Uh, in some scenarios, we can't ride the cranes while they're in operation to take the vibration data so in those scenarios, we would have to lock the crane out, put all of our sensors on every component that we wanted to monitor, link those back into a collection base, and just hit record, and record all of that data after we unlock the crane and let, let operations have it. And then lock the crane back out, get on board, get our data collector, get all of our cables back off and go back to the office and do diagnostics. So there are ways to get on these, even if you have a really stringent, really tight safety uh, guideline for crane access, there are ways to get up there and take the data safely and take it in a proper manner to get meaningful results. To learn more about condition monitoring of your critical assets, contact us at ivctechnologies.com.